I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Bremerton High School. It's January 14th. I'm Caroline. I'm Rashawn. One more month till Valentine's Day, so ask that special someone out and watch the bulletin. Activity for the week. Thursday, January 15, the girls bowling with Peninsula away at 2.45 p.m. Boys swimming with Port Angeles away at 3.30 p.m. And wrestling with Olympic away JV at 6 and Varsity at 7. Friday, January 16th, Martin Luther King Assembly Gym at 1 p.m. Girls basketball with Kingston home JV at 5.15 and Varsity at 7 p.m. Boys basketball with Kingston away JV at 5.15 and Varsity at 7 p.m. And Saturday, January 17th, CK Matman Tournament, away at CK all day, and there's also a cheer competition. Our staff and students, here's Josh with sports. In sports, the boys' basketball team is rolling over their opponents last night. Whooping up on Scram 54-38, to Josh Coates had 19 points, Jay Tondell had 9 points. The Knights moved two games ahead of Olympic in the Battle of the Class 3A's number two postseason berth, Kyle Kenny, did a great job on camera, as did Kendra Needham and the, all of the TV crew. The, fr the game will air Friday after the ga girls' game live. Also, the girls also won their game last night, 54 to 35. Jalen Carpenter had 32 points. Do you dare not to swear? Today's words of wisdom are: swearing doesn't show who you are as a person. Swearing makes you seem unintelligent, so please don't swear. That was Delta Lee Cummings, BHS student. Due to the holidays, on Monday, Ping Pong Club will meet on Tuesday in the Commons at 2 p.m. Come join and be prepared to play. And Knights, this is the Night Note Alert. Night Notes are Cain, though, so students be aware and teacher be prepared. Get caught showing your night pride. Get caught turning your attitude around and bringing your grades up. Key Club will meet after school today. Also, anyone interested or curious about hosting a French student in the spring should stop by the French classroom, room 246, after school today and speak to Ms. Kilberg. Skills USA meet Thursday after school in room 125 at 205. Please bring your many regional permission slips to the meeting if you have not already turned them in. We have much to accomplish, so please be on time, Dr. Jones. Armandar Elementary School is looking for service-oriented students willing to chaperone fourth grade students during their outdoor education experience at Islandwood Camp on Bainbridge Island. The camp runs from March 9 to March 12 with all food, lodging, and transportation provided by Armandar. Interested students can pick up an application due January 29th in the main office. Training will be provided by the staff at Islandwood on Wednesday, February 25th for students who are selected. Have you got any hidden talents that you would like to share with your fellow students? The talent show is Thursday, January 22nd. The talent show auditions will be held after school today in the auditorium. Sign up for audition on Miss Van Valkenburg's door, room 234. A new year is a perfect time to get a new attitude towards getting into better shape for your sports team. Don't you wish that you could be in kick butt shape and super condition when the season starts? Take some action and make that wish a reality. Off-season athletic conditioning with Miss Nicholas starts back up on the 13th. Bring your shoes and a good attitude and see you Tuesdays and Thursdays morning, 6 o'clock to 6.45 a.m. in the gym. Yes, it's early, but that's a great way to start your day. Let's go Knights. And birthdays. Johannes Bello. Patrick Burt. Jawan Johnson. Tyler Leonard. Ryan McCormick. Nolan Mulka. And Adam Schaffer. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Daily thought. Choose each day to feel the way you wish to feel, no matter what is going on around you. Let your feelings pull you towards the fulfillment of your destiny. And daily joke. Why can't a woman ask her brother for help? I don't know why. Because he can't be her brother and assist her too. 
All right, this day in history, in 1784, the United States ratified a peace treaty with England, ending the Revolutionary War. In 1993, talk show host David Letterman announced that he was moving from NBC to CBC. CBS. CBS. <laughs> and that was your bulletin. Have a nice day. <laughs> Have a nice day. Have a really nice day.